If you're a fan of craft beer in Japan, you've probably heard of Bear Beer, a local brewery which has several tap rooms in Tokyo, Kanagawa, and Izu. Now, you can drink Bear here at one of Japan's largest ski resorts, Hakuba Hapo One in Nagano. This is the first tap room that's not owned directly by uh, the Baird Brewing Company. It's, uh, it's owned and operated by ourselves, um, my family. We, we bought the hotel in September. In the lead up to that, I was thinking about what to do with the restaurant and bar space. I wanted to do a bit something more. I wanted to put in a craft beer bar. It just struck me. I, I've always loved Baird beer, and Baird struck me as a natural partner. I have most of the year-round Baird beers. I have a few seasonal Baird beers, and uh, I have uh, one or two guest beers, depending on the time of year. And so right now, we have uh, the Hakuba Brewing Company, which is our local brewer. Um, we have one of their guest beers on top, their Amber Ale. We, we kind of had a nice situation because uh, our, our hotel manager is a yakitori chef for several years. It's kind of my view that yakitori pair, like, pairs very well with beer. And we have various things on the menu to, to pair with the different beer flavors. So if it's a stout, you know, we have things that kind of go with the stout. Or if it's people are drinking lager, we have lighter chicken things or the pale ale. There's not too many yakitori places in Hakuba. We have, we have so many tourists coming to this area and people want to eat Japanese food. I moved to Japan when I was 19 to study Japanese. Um, I was also really into snowboarding and I met so many Japanese in the States that were into snowboarding too and I thought, you know, I could build a life for myself in Japan if I learned the language and maybe get a job in the snowboard industry and so I learned the language, uh, moved to Japan and got a job in Tokyo in a bank of all things. Just gave that up a few months ago to start a tap room here in, here in Hakuba. Yeah, so most of the hotels close after winter. Um, we're going to stay open year-round. The Hakuba Valley has incredible mountain biking. The hiking's phenomenal. I'm a kayaker. Like the rivers around here are amazing. The fishing's amazing. We're very close to the monkey, you know, the, the monkey park. We, foreigners love that. They love going to the temples in Nagano and Mount, the castle in Matsumoto. So we still have a lot of those cultural aspects. Well, up until September of this year, we came up to Hakuba every single weekend. We finished work at around 5 p.m. on Friday night. And then we hop on the Shinkansen. We get off at Nagano. We had a car parked there. We drive out here, spend two days up in the mountains, um, just Skiing in the, in the wintertime, in the summertime, we did hiking or biking, and then hop back on the Shinkansen on Sunday night and come home. And we decided that we wanted to come up here full time, but initially we didn't know what the plans were going to be, whether um, we'd be able to make enough money or keep ourselves busy enough. But the purchase of this hotel and making the tap room really gave us a reason to pack up and move up here to the Hazaba full time try to be open full year so people know that they can come here anytime. And just around Golden Week is when the Sakura is in full bloom here. So it finishes in April in Tokyo, and out here it's just around Golden Week. Um, and you can see the snow as well as the Sakura, which is a beautiful time. Um, so there's so much more to enjoy in Hakuba than just the ski slope. We have this craft beer bar in a hotel. So you can come to our hotel. You're 400 meters from the ski slopes. We've got the best beer in Japan, if not one of the best beers in the planet. We have an onsen in the hotel for the right people, the people that like those things, you know, it's, I, I think we have a very unique product. Um, I think we've got something special for people. We create an environment here that's super family friendly. My kids run around all the time. Everybody's kids are running around. It feels like home. And I want to show you around my backyard, you know. I've been coming to this place for 15 years. I love it here. Um, the mountains are my home and I, I just want to share that with people who love beer and love the mountains as well.